ഹലോ ഫ്രണ്ട്സ് വെൽക്കം ടു ഇ സി അക്കാഡമി ഇൻ ദിസ് ലെക്ചർ ലെറ്റ് എസ് അണ്ടർസ്റ്റാൻഡ് ദി കമ്പാരിജൻ ബിറ്റ്വീൻ ബ്ലോക്ക് ഡയഗ്രാം ആൻഡ് സിഗ്നൽ ഫ്ലോഗ്രാഫ് മെത്തേഡ്സ് ബോത്ത് ബ്ലോക്ക് ഡയഗ്രാം ആസ് വെൽ ആസ് സിഗ്നൽ ഫ്ലോഗ്രാഫ് ആർ യൂസ്ഡ് ടു ഫൈൻഡ് ദി ഓവറോൾ ട്രാൻസ്ഫർ ഫംഗ്ഷൻ ഓഫ് ദി ഗിവൺ സിസ്റ്റം both block diagram as well as signal flow graph methods are applicable only to LTI system so we can say block diagram method is applicable only to LTI systems the signal flow graph is also applicable only to LTI systems in block diagram method each element is represented by the block in signal flow graph method each variable is represented by the node in block diagram each element is represented by block in signal flow graph each variable is represented by node in case of block diagram summing point and take off points are represented separately but in signal flow graph there are no summing point and take off point both summing point and take off points are represented by node so in block diagram summing point and take off point are separate in signal flow graph summing point and take off point are not present both summing point and take off points are represented by nodes so we can say they are represented by nodes the concept of self loop is not exist in block diagram approach self loop can exist in signal flow graph approach so we can say in block diagram self loop do not exist in case of signal flow graph self loop can exist the block diagram method is a slightly complicated and time consuming as block diagram is required to be drawn and this block diagram should be reduced to obtain the overall transfer function in case of signal flow graph no need to draw signal flow graph again and again once the signal flow graph is drawn we can use masson's gain formula to obtain the overall transfer function so we can say block diagram method is time consuming and signal flow graph requires less time in case of block diagram method feedback path is present from output to input in signal flow graph instead of feedback path various feedback loops are considered for the analysis so we can write feedback path is present in signal flow graph feedback loop is present in block diagram method block diagram reduction rules are used to obtain the resulting transfer function in case of uh, signal flow graph masson's gain formula is used to obtain the overall transfer function in block diagram block diagram reduction rules are used in case of signal flow graph masson's gain formula is used this is about the comparison between block diagram method and signal flow graph method hope you have understood the topic thank you